folk rock supergroup Crosby, Stills & Nash have reunited in an effort to pull their music from Spotify in support of Neil Young. Yeah, you got to stick together with your bandmates, right? That's what it's about. David Crosby and Steven Stills are supporting former bandmate Neil Young and Graham Nash, who recently asked for their music to be taken down from Spotify's 172 million subscribers. Now, Young started this trend when he pulled his solo catalog from the streaming service last week due to the fake information about vaccines being spread on the most popular podcast on Spotify the Joe Rogan experience. Artists continue to drop off, but Spotify had good news to report. Their monthly active users are up 18% from last year. Even though these numbers have no correlation to the current drama with musicians, it does help to change the narrative. It's just ironic timing, and we'll have to wait until next quarter to see if these protests will have an economic impact. Although musicians have been outspoken about the fact that this is more about principle. They know that they aren't going to move the needle in terms of Spotify's numbers. They just don't want to be aligned with Spotify. Anymore. I think. I, thank you for making that point, because I think at the end of the day, if all 11 million or however many people are listening to Joe Rogan's podcast, they start saying something. Spotify is going to be paying attention. Absolutely. And they could just go to a different platform. Yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to click on the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.